guys, welcome back to another episode of The Sims 4 Cottage of Living where we're back with Ian and Derek just waking up to start yet another morning. It's actually a Saturday morning so I mean it's not like they have work anyway but they it's, it's a nice chill day. They don't have to worry too much about anything apart from looking after the animals of course and maybe the flowers. I, uh, plants. <laughs> I did kind of forget about these giant crops we've got growing which we planted in the last episode I think. I've already got these guys on their morning schedules making sure that everything is going to be fulfilled. I've got you doing the cooking of the breakfast because he's actually level 10 in the cooking skill. I can't remember if I knew that already or not but he is. Well you're gonna maintain the chickens. So it's already all sorted and <laughs> oh yeah we ended the last episode on a uh, pretty dramatic note or I guess life changing it would definitely be um and the answer that Derek gave to this question I think it was Derek it was Ian that asked the question either way one of them <laughs> suggested the question of should we adopt and the other one <laughs> said yes they said yes, and they're going to go through with it, I think, today. Or at least start the plans. I have this mod, I can't remember who's, who it's by, that makes adopting more elaborate, which is why they were able to ask each other this question. I can't remember who it was, but the fact that they both agreed on doing it yeah, makes it more special to me anyway, so... It's fine, they both had the idea, they both want it to happen, and they think they want to adopt a boy, but they don't know the age yet. I don't know if they want to go for a child or a teen. I don't think we'll do toddler because they might not be around long enough to see them to adulthood. <laughs> but I think they want to adopt an older child just because I don't think older kids get adopted that often. It's always from really the younger ones. And they definitely want to adopt a boy. So a boy they'd be able to relate to a bit more. Yeah, I that then. If you understand that, then it's good. <laughs> oh jeez. Wait, can you just come and eat your breakfast because you're really hungry? It's not good quality. Hang on. How have you made poor quality? How have you made poor quality eggs and toast? Is it because the eggs we used were bad? Were bad because I'm pretty sure you used his own, our own eggs. Oh, we have we have we've got a book to publish. We should publish that. Where's our mailbox? All the way over here. Okay, we can go publish that book. We're gonna self-publish it because have some confidence in yourself. Probably won't make as much money. I think that's how it works. I don't remember. I didn't read. Put that away. Do we still have this hot the this, this task we need to do? Yes. Deliver free chocolate berries to the creature keeper. We can invite him over and be like, hey, hi, how you coming in? No? Can we not? Wait, does that mean he's here? Wait, where'd he go? <laughs> Wait, is Ooh, no no no, don't wanna be doing that. Is that camera on? Oh, he's in the area. Okay. That's a bit weird. Um, deliver the choco berries, I guess. The choco berries? Why does that remind me of Final Fantasy stuff? <laughs> is there is there something called a choco berry in Final Fantasy? I don't know. Um, it's choco berries. We I don't remember what I got you making. Those are just medium shapes, right? He's just here doing his little cross stitching. It's been a while since I've cross stitched in real life. Quite painful when you stab yourself. <laughs> you should be wearing a thimble. Um, yeah, that, that's why you wear a thimble. Because <laughs> you don't do that. Well, I'm excited to see how that comes along. Hello? Whoa, where are you going? Oh, yeah, self publishing. Okay, I guess he didn't want to do it anymore. Didn't, oh, dogs in heat. I'm sure it's fine. I'm sure he won't be running off getting some imprint. You're a boy, right? You're, you're a fox? Fox, your boy. How do I tell? <laughs> they don't breathe too slow that often. You're you're a boy, right? <laughs> Fox. Duh. Okay, I have no idea how I'm supposed to tell. Probably a boy. Just don't go off getting any doggos pregnant. Are you on your way to deliver these berries? Cool. Okay. What's the other thing we need to do? Eat a mushroom mash. Hey, hey. Yeah. I got you your thingy that you huh. wanted. <laughs> Where's the rest of us? Well, uh, 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 progression gonna have six spicy mushrooms to the creature keeper. Well, is that it? There was no, like, story <laughs> to go with it? It's just, that's it? A 
Okay, go fine. Um, do I have six sided mushrooms for the peach cube? Or do we have six sided mushrooms? No, we have a charming mushroom and a lovely mushroom. Um, I guess we can quickly look for some mushrooms. Whoops, green bug, I don't care about you. We're not living in on the board. Look at these ridiculous mushrooms. Rooster chicken love probably is growing rooster. I'll try out rooster chicken in the morning to protect other chickens from foxes. And we'll try to breed with hens in the same coop as a great hatchable egg. Oh, a chick grew up. It was a rooster. Do we have more hatchable eggs or are these these are eggs we've just got from it? Oh. You found a mushroom before you'd even picked it. Okay. Please give me a second one. Please. Give me a second. Okay. <laughs> well, we're going back home. He's uncomfortable. Why are you uncomfortable? Don't be wet. What? Oh. <laughs> These guys are not having a great day. Oh, but he finished it. Uh. Did I see it? No, he didn't finish it. Okay. <laughs> it was just finished in his inventory. We have this cheese one that I got him to make as well, which we could probably sell. We need money. Um, okay. Well. Adopting. <laughs> How does one start adopting? Uh, Derek must discuss this with his official partner first to have uh, have them agree. Did it? Did they not count as being agreed in this topic? What if you do it? Adoption. Discuss adopting the child. Okay. Apparently, we have to ask again, which is fine. Where are you going? Oh, yes, okay, well, just go straight to Derek. Don't worry about going to the door. Oh, I am a bunny. I just saw a bunny. <laughs> go! Go! Okay. Well, let's re oh! Let's re ask the question. Do you want to adopt a kiddo? Yeah, I want to adopt a kiddo. Why not? The more the merrier. There we go. So now we can start the process, right? So who has to do it? Fill online adoption in the academy. Yeah, yeah. Yes. Fill the online adoption community. Where would you go? There? Ooh, okay. So Derek adopt through the Sims foster care system, costing 500 faster, less selective, less choice, or through the Sims World Agency for adoption, costs 5,000. More selective with more choice. I want to go through the world agency. I want more selection and more choice in the kids that I adopt. I don't want to just adopt a random child and not be compatible, you know? So, through the world agency. Um, make a good impression. We don't want to skip the visit. Okay. Why are you flirty? <laughs> Why are you flirty? The jungle thingies. We're talking about children. I'm not making children in that way. Oh, there's a fox. Uh, hunter. Chat to hunter. <laughs> this is good. Oh! No, Derek, our system sees your application for adopting. We will re review it as soon as possible. The major part of your application review is done in person for your home visit. One of our agents will come to visit promptly. Wait, how promptly? So please stay home. We do not set appointments so that people cannot... We do not set appointments so that people cannot prepare for the visit in a way that may serve misleading to our agents. We do not rec we do recommend dressing appropriately. Oh, <laughs> ah, we do not get to prepare. Well, these guys are kind of um prepared anyway, right? Um, I don't see anything that's wrong with the house. Or much that could go wrong. We could make sure that our pet bowls filled so it looks like that we give our fox a lot of attention which we do fox the fox gets attention we can play with him and he's happy <laughs> um and about dressing appropriately i'm not sure it is cold so wearing warm clothes would be appropriate but ah <laughs> i'm worried now i don't know it's like it's like it's not like he's walking around in his underwear so i'm i'm, I'm assuming it'll be fine are you done with this? Oh, cool. Okay, now can we see it? Uh, wait. Uh, <laughs> what? I'm confused. 
but it, there, there we go. It's some pretty flowers in a nice, pleasing shape. Oh my gosh, go away. Okay. <laughs> I kind of want to start selling these so we have extra money. Because we're going to need it if we're raising a kid. Why did I, I want to put the stitchers I took together down. Look at this. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Uh, no, add frame. Next frame. There we go. And then we can carry these ones. <laughs> Don't know who wants to buy pictures of an old married couple, but that's fine. I guess we've got to wait for the adoption agency now. Oh, oh perfect timing. Here comes the adoption agent, ready to address Derek in his home. Hopefully Derek is prepared for it. They will ask him some questions of specific order. We check all their boxes. So the best, so it's best if Derek doesn't try to talk about anything until prompted. All right. Um, well, we better go let her in. Hey there, friendly introduction. Dirk. Dirk McMillan. You have uh, quite an important role to do. I feel like Ian's just gonna stay out of the way. Because we don't. That's really noisy. <laughs> why, is, why is it so noisy? He's probably gonna stay out of the way, so. Not like to be rude or anything, but he doesn't want- he, I feel like he's afraid of messing something up. He's more comfortable being out here with the chickens and the plants and making sure everything is functioning out here. Out here. I guess come over. Well, we probably should talk at some point. We, you, you can come over. You can you can help him with his nerves. Because <laughs> he's probably not in a great state right now. Uh, can we take the bug? And just make sure our plants are good <laughs> and he's just distracting himself in every way possible from from this two special eggs have been collected oh and the flinch witch fair has started oh i kind of want to do that hang 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 on <laughs> show fire information bring your luckiest cookiest chicken to the to compete in the chicken competition Purchase unique items at local shops. Purchase unique items and sell your own wares for more simoleons than normal. Egg competition, bring the best eggs and win an excellent prize. <laughs> win ribbons, complete the fair competitions to win ribbons. You can't travel when, when the situation is right. Okay, yeah, well, we'll it's uh, until 9.30. We've got <laughs> probably not enough time. That's, that's kind of sad. Um... I should probably check that. <laughs> well, I kind of want to go. We've got like special eggs. Do we just get special eggs? No. I thought we got we got told we got two special this eggs. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. We need to be asking this stuff. Say something funny to the adoption agent. Where is she? <laughs> Where? Why has she walked off? Hey, Miss Adoption Agent, we need to say something funny to you. Tell a funny story about um your childhood when you fell off your bike <laughs> and 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 it was funny because you fell on a puddle yes <laughs> it's so funny i'm not very good at making things up on the spot maybe he's telling a genuine story or, or maybe not maybe since it didn't go well discuss earnings of the adoption agency so uh we kind of live off the land we don't really have a stable <laughs> income it's more completely reliant on on what the animals are doing and how they're and how, and how, how productive they are and how well we look after them <laughs> so we don't exactly have a career just ask Talk about finances and talk about trip. Yeah. You <laughs> don't exactly make a lot of money. Oh no! I really hope this goes well. But the more I'm listening to our situation, the more it doesn't sound like a great idea. Explain why you want children. Because, well, we're a gay couple, for one. We can't. We can't. Well, we want to adopt. Why are you running off? Woman? Woman! She's off. She's already knows this is a bad idea. Oh my gosh. Okay. Please say we want to talk about why we want to adopt, which is because we are a gay couple and we're elders and we don't have any children and we want them. We've decided really late in our lives 
that we would like a child and since we're elders we cannot have a child on our own so we thought we'd adopt a child that's been neat is that enough of an explanation uh adopt talk about our housing arrangement and uh discuss property values yeah let's discuss our housing situation why why are we out here can we please sit inside it's much warmer than outdoors it is kind of cool Discuss family and social networking with your relations. Well, you see, I'm an I'm a really introverted author, so I don't have that many friends. But my husband, on the other hand, has has a wish to become friends with lots of people, and is already friends with quite a few people. And we don't have any family, but but will the family he needs? We have chickens and a dog, and I'm sure he can go for that, right? <laughs> Me too. Be friendly with the adoption agent. Oh, please stop walking off. I really require you to stay in one place. Okay, well, okay. All we need to do is be friendly. So ask about her. And that's enough about me. What about you, you know? Okay, it's raining. <laughs> that's a bad sign. Oh, she's uncomfortable. That's an even worse sign. Settle again in the present conversation. We're being friendly. Oh, we need to be friendly a few more times than that. There's a fox. So stalking the, the chicken pen. Hang on. Shoo flinigan away while we uh, talk civilly about to our adoption agent. Oh, <laughs> please do not ask me to use my maid. Oh, God. You shoo little fox. Thank you. Oh, that's good. Oh, the chickens are okay. They're making bro. <laughs> the chickens, the chickens are creating more chickens. That's good. We need more chickens. Why are these sprinklers still on? You can turn off now. <laughs> You've been sprinkling all day. Didn't we invite a friend over? Is that is that not happening anymore? <gasps> We're done. We're done. We're done. I don't care about a personality type. We're done with the, with the adoption. The adoption. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Adoption and anything is done. It's not telling me any updates on the adoption situation. Oh no, he's embarrassed. But money isn't everything. The state of Derek's finances did not impress the adoption agent. Derek can only hope that this won't be enough to jeopardize his application. No career being unemployed definitely didn't help Derek make a good impression with his adoption application. Uh oh. <laughs> That's not good. Um. <laughs> Hopefully everything else that we did was enough to to to, co to convince her. I'm gonna be really sad if they can't adopt. They're gonna have to both get jobs and, and make more of an effort to look appealing. Oh dear. Well, whether it went well or not, the home visit part of Derek's application adoption application is over. The agent says he can expect a, a decision letter in the mail within a day or two. Oh, I'm so nervous. <laughs> I'm so nervous. Okay, we need to rush over to the fair because I want to at least get a glimpse of it. I don't know if we're going to be able to participate at all, but I want a glimpse of it, please. So if we can just find where it is, there it is. Travel to the fair with the whole house. Go. I can scroll for that. Was she just hitting on him? I didn't, I didn't read what that text message said. I'm, ass I'm assuming she was not hitting on me. Hey, here we are. I dug with the pub. Interesting. I think we're fair. <laughs> Doesn't look like there's anything going on. Sims looking for a lover in the right place at singles night. That means our flirty single sims can buy each other drinks on the cheap. Well, <laughs> that's not at all what we're doing here. We need a chicken in our inventory to participate. Well, I wasn't planning on participating really. We haven't been to the main street much. We've been to the pub and only the pub. But we haven't actually explored the main street very much. So we could be doing that since everything else is closed. There's nothing going on here. Oh, the bush is moving. That's weird. But <laughs> That's weird. Why is it moving like that? I guess everything's over with. Oh, do you think that's it? I thought it didn't. Oh, you have a chicken. 
Do I have a chicken saw? Saya. Oh my god, there are chickens being added onto the display. Oh, I kind of wish we grabbed a chicken now. <laughs> it's a bit too late. It's going to start soon. Am I used to sex with this people? Oh, look at these two just sitting here. I wonder if they're talking about the adoption. The adoption agency coming over. And he's probably a bit sad that he didn't quite do that well. <gasps> no, it's okay. I'm sure you did great. He's gonna Hello talk about his insecurities, and, and Ian's gonna be like, "No, I'm sure, I'm sure it went fine. We'll, we'll <laughs> discuss that's fine in earnest. <laughs> you, you can be like me and just power through it. Then something else to do with violence. <laughs> I don't know. Are these guys the judges? They're wearing matching clothes. They're all <laughs> wearing very matchy clothes. Can we do something with this? <gasps> we can view the competition entry. Yes, let's go view them. We can cooperate. The festival will end in one hour. Finish up any activities before it closes. Be sure to come back next time the festival is in town. I don't understand. How do we know <laughs> about winning and stuff? I don't know. Can we only view it? We can't, like, submit a score or something? Careful around this chicken, I'm pretty sure it stepped in something. I just always said this chicken pecked them. Maybe it's evil. Ha! <laughs> evil chickens. Nah, evil chickens don't exist. Are eggs supposed to smell like this? Wait, oh, this one's like an egg display? <gasps> Look at this one, it's green! Green egg, hatchable no. <laughs> Are eggs supposed to smell like this? Are we gonna find any green ham? Or is it just green eggs? This is <laughs> weird. <laughs> I don't know. I don't get it. Where, where does this egg even come from? A chicken? It doesn't seem normal. No way it's winning. How do we know the winners? I want to know the winners. Can I know? Oh, well, it's ep it should have ended, right? <laughs> Surely it should have ended by now. Oh, we can save the parts of money. Does this egg even come from a chicken? It doesn't look normal. No way it's winning. Who would think of that? You think that about a few eggs now, don't you? Oh, oh no, everything's starting to disappear. Uh, please, quick, get your pets before they get taken. Before they disappear. Oh, actions. Okay. <laughs> Not really sure what's going on there. Why are you complaining? Oh, because the bin also disappeared. Well, isn't that just a shame? Probably we can throw it away somewhere else. Please stop standing on the rubbish. I'm trying to be a good civilian and clean it up. Thank you. Well, everyone's going home. Well, <laughs> Flinchwick fail. We could at least, or maybe not use those because the bar is open. We could at least get some food from the bar and what if the bartenders aren't on duty? Oh, you're going to take it up? I, I don't know. I'm just going to take it up. Where did you get food from? Where did you find food? Oh, somebody just made some food. All right. Well, you're not really that hungry, but you could probably come and get food anyway. Why are you bored? Boring fair entry. There's nothing special about this fair competition. Where are all the interesting submissions? Do sim do s don't sims have pride anymore? Oh, that's sad. We'll, we'll try and enter an interesting submission uh, next year when it comes around. But I wasn't really expecting a competition in fall. Like, I remember we looked and there weren't any until, yeah, these times. But I guess there were hidden ones with the little flags. So there is one tomorrow. The Festival of Youth. Oh, okay. It's not a Flinchwick one. That's irritating. When is the next Flin uh, Flinchwick Garden Fair? Okay, what's this one about? Hi, competition. E garden competition. Oh, maybe we should try and make a really good pie or something cool with the garden. <laughs> I don't know. We should we should look into that for the for the next competition. Maybe we can actually Goodbye. enter something good. Why are we being attacked? Like that? <laughs> anyway, what? Why are we being attacked like that? That's weird. Can we put this in our inventory? Back into sack lunch. I don't know. I kind of want to take it back home. <laughs> Okay, well I suppose we'll head home and go to bed, because my gosh, it's 12am. <laughs> go home! Wait, no! Don't forget about your friends! 
No, no, put this in your inventory. And now go home. <laughs> you wouldn't forget to long you in. Long you, Derek. Okay. Okay, well, we've made it home. At <laughs> this terrible time. So, these guys are probably gonna wake up super early because they like to wake up at 6 and make sure the farm's in order, you know? But maybe, maybe they'll be sleeping in tonight because it is really late and they are both really tired. You probably shouldn't be having a bath like this <laughs> when, you're, when you're this tired. Don't, just be careful in that and stuff. Okay, well, with that, I'm gonna leave this episode here and hopefully we get our adoption reply in the, in the post in, in the next episode. My gosh. My words. Yes, I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye. Drove his Baron? Big boobies, didn't you? Ah, uh, sure, sure. Noy. Noy. Brass Bobsol? Chixi? Hish? Pimsola Goosh?